guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for tuning in so guys as usual i am here again with another wig install styling and all of that good stuff first of all this wig is from Kois Kois. you guys should get used to this brand on my channel okay because they are literally one brand i will recommend with my full chest so Koi Koi sent me these 4C Edges Kinky Coily Tipper Front Lace Wig. Guys, this is the first time I'm working with this kind of wig and I am so excited. You guys know I'm a natural hair babe, so things like this just get me excited because I love working with wigs that end up looking like my actual hair. Like, it makes me so excited. So this is exactly what this wig look like, but before I go into details, let's go ahead and condition this hair. This hair came in kinky coily 4C slash 4B pattern and it's also 18 inches. So it's a lot going on in there. So I would love to condition it to just kind of fluff it out and also soften the actual hair. So going ahead, I've said this a couple of times in my video. When you're conditioning your kinky coily hair, do not use comb yet. Make sure you use finger detangling method to detangle it so you don't pull out a lot of hair. Even at that, you can use like maybe like a, a big tooth comb because at the end of the day koi koi's hair barely shed that's one thing i love about their brand i've worked with them so many times and their hair do not shed like it's barely shed so but for me i love to use my finger tally method it just helped me work well with the hair so guys this is what it looks like this wig is giving everything like i'm just so excited to see how it's going to look on me so i'm going to go ahead and just uh, make sure i rinse out the conditioner very well then place it on my mannequin because this is the first time I'm working with hair like this, with this whole frontal thing going on. Guys, you guys can hear from my voice. I'm so excited. I'm going to be first of all arranging it here. First of all, I want to pat it very well to make sure I give that clear, natural looking pattern. Like I mentioned earlier, this is a tippered front lace wig. So you want to make sure that, you know, you give it that natural looking line. Then I went ahead and also trimmed down the edges because we want to make sure it's looking on natural. I mean, one of the things we know about edges is that they are not so long. They are just those tiny hair growing at the front of your hair. And that's exactly what we are going with, trying to make it look all natural. So after trimming down my edges, I go ahead and work with the body of the hair. All you have to do, just treat this hair the way you treat your actual hair. Apply in some water for hydration, go in with your leave-in conditioner, call activator, whatever you want to use. It's totally fine. But for me, I'm using a leave-in conditioner. And guys, this hair, the texture is so beautiful. And one thing I love most about this texture of hair, this type of texture, is the fact that it can blend in into so many hair patterns like 3C to 4A and it will come out looking perfect. So guys, I went ahead and made sure like I conditioned the hair entirely just the way you do to your actual hair. You don't want to leave the hair looking frizzy and all of that. So adding hydration and moisture just help moisturize the hair and also define the coil more and just make your hair looking all okay. kill. So now that we're done, let's go. I'm so excited. I just can't wait to see how it looks on me. So the so the next thing I did is grab my actual shade foundation and you know just shade those lays so it can be giving your scalp. I love the fact that all coil coils we come with this type of strap. It just help grip your hair more tightly. So guys, after uh putting this on my hair, I went ahead to trim off the the lace i have to go to the mirror like i literally left my seat and went to the mirror side because my mirror was fine for me so i trim off the lace then i went ahead and flattened that middle like i mentioned earlier we are going with something looking natural and let's see how we can achieve that so i pick up a little foundation and just add it to the front so so it kind of look more realistic and like you know this is my scalp kind of vibe so for me, I use a little bit of spray just to like spray around it. This is perfectly uh, okay. With this wig, you don't need to like use like a serious glue to glue your entire edges and the entire frontal. With just a simple spray like this, you are very good to go. So I'm going to go ahead and tie it down a little bit so it just hold everything down. We want to make sure it is holding down perfectly well. Then I just leave for like two minutes or thereabout. Then I'm going to just take it off and this is what we got so now the edges is sitting perfectly i'm going to go ahead and comb it out and start working on it so the idea of this edges is that i want to make it look you know still looking like really natural i don't want to like swoop it and make it slick down so much i just want to give you that natural looking so i'm just going to go ahead and grab my edge control and just just give you like a natural looking laying down i don't want to I don't know i'm going to explain this but like i don't want to lay it like perfectly well looking all swoop and all slick just so it can look natural okay so uh after turning down for some minutes i went ahead and just um 
losing it and this is how it looks now it's laying down with the edge control i'm going to go ahead and fluff out the hair at the front so i'm going to go ahead and use my fingers to fluff it out like i said i want like a more natural looking edges i don't want it looking all sleek and perfect just looking a little bit of you know that natural looking edges that is what i am going for and i think you know we are there okay i totally love this hair and you guys look how fluffy that hair looks and the hair texture is so soft it literally feel like real natural hair so all i have to do now is just work on the strand i spray some water because i feel it is dry just spray some water and the curl will come back popping also all it is about this hair is going to be in my oh my god look at that so guys when i said i was going for natural looking edges this was exactly what i meant you see like she's giving that natural looking edges it is not slick and lay down like it's just giving girls that get it get it if you don't you're just not that girl okay <laughs> Honestly, I love how this hair turned out and I'm so excited about it. All the details about this hair is going to be in my description box. Also, the direct link to this particular wig is also going to be in my description box. Guess what? Of course, you can use my discount code Ngozi to get some coin of your order, of your purchase. And guys, I was feeling myself at this point. So you guys already know me that there's no how I will, you know, install a wig without giving you guys one or two style. So I went ahead and just, let me just explore this wig. I don't know my foundation stained up, but so I just have to clean it off. So I went ahead and just do this simple style. Guys, Guys, this style was looking so good this made it look like my actual hair and i'm stepping out in a bit to go chill with my friends and guys i totally like i really can't wait to go out with this it looks like my actual hair you guys see that edges i'm talking about giving it all natural this looks so pretty and i love it i look like a goddess <laughs> I love to hype myself. This wig just looks so good. Koi Koi's will never disappoint. And also, there's a direct link to this particular hair in my description box. And you can also use my discount code Ngozi and get some coin off your purchase. And as usual, I went ahead and explored more other styles with this wig. And guess what? Like, I tried this style this style so many style look at these look at this one this one or oh, this one like i did so many style with this hair and it came out looking good so guys that's all about this video okay, that's in for this video don't forget to like this video comment down below subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys definitely in my next video do not miss out of this hair don't say i did not tell you okay